it takes humility. Certainly it takes humility to give full attention to the Lord Jesus speaking to us without hearing the Lord Jesus demonstrated by humbly submitting to his instructions, we could have no relationship with him and thus no relationship with the Heavenly Father. We must never forget that for our deliverance from sin and the weaknesses of our carnal flesh, our Heavenly Father has spoken to us by his Son, the Lord Jesus, that gives us by his word wise counsels that we may know his ways to live by. And by his Holy Spirit, we are given remembrance and guidance in the Lord's wise counsels. Psalm 95, 6 through 10. O come, let us worship and bow down. Let us kneel before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God, and we are the people of his pasture, and the sheep of his hand. Today, if ye will hear his voice, hard not your hearts, as in the provocation, and as in the day of temptation in the wilderness, when your fathers tempted me, proved me, and saw my work, forty years long was I great with this generation, and said, It is a people that do err in their heart, and they have not known my ways. Hebrews 1, 1 through 2. God, who at sundry times and in diverse manners spake in time past unto the fathers by the prophets, hath in these last days spoken unto us by his Son, whom he hath appointed heir of all things, by whom also he made the worlds. 1 Corinthians 2.12 Now we have received not the Spirit of the world, but the Spirit which is of God, that we might know the things that are freely given to us of God.